So here's Stand By Me on the guitar. Now for the guitar, the top four strings are the same as the, when I say the top, I mean the thickest four, the highest one from the ground. They're the same as the bass guitar. So we're just going to concentrate on those today, but actually we only need the top two strings, the thickest two strings. And you're going to need to watch what the right hand thumb does in a second. But first of all, let's have a look at the left hand. So, every time we go up one of these lines, they're called frets. That's going up a semitone, like moving up between the black note and the white note on the piano. And all the strings are different pitches, so we can get gradually higher as we go up the guitar. So we'll look at that when we get on to um, the actual guitar units. But for now, you need to know that this, this string here, the second one down, the second thickest string, is the A string. So A, B flat, B natural, C. So that's where our bass line starts, isn't it? C, C, and then same finger pressing on the fattest string is a G. And obviously the one next to C is B. So it goes three, three, change strings. Three, change strings. Two, three, 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 two, open, which means I don't use any of my left hand fingers. Open, change strings. G, that's the third fret. Open on the fifth string from the floor. One, two, three, four, five. That's what we call it, the A string. Open, open for the A. Open, change strings. G, F, 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 A, which is the a string, obviously, G, change strings, G, G, change strings, B, C, C, G, B, C, that was G, B, C, so the whole thing, C, C, I'll do it slowly, G, B, C, 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 B, A, A, G, A, 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 G, F, 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 A, G, 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 B, C, C, G, B, C, C. Now I'm just going to play it with one finger so you can see where the notes really go. Again with all the fingers. We're only using two fingers so far. Now I use my other finger. Back to the two fingers. And just as a reminder, we need to look at what my right hand is doing. So which strings am I plucking? Plucking with my right hand thumb, just by pushing lightly down towards the floor, not dragging my thumb behind the string, pushing lightly down to the floor. Change strings. There's the fat string. And again. Go back to the beginning, don't we? So good luck with learning that. 